Thank you for purchasing the Ditch Hitch Vehicle Recovery System. This instructional video will review how the Ditch Hitch System works, describe the components of the system and how they are assembled, and review important information for the safe operation of the system. Your complete Ditch Hitch System includes the following. Two full Ditch Hitch units. One Fuse Link Strap. The Fuse Link Strap is available in 2-inch, 25-foot configurations. One Safety Reflector Sleeve one pre-job checklist, and one ditch hitch system carrying bag. Each single ditch hitch unit includes the following. One 2x2 two two inch solid aluminum bar, one U-bar unit, two specialty pins which are connected by cable, and two safety clips. The ditch hitch system is easy to use and assemble, and it fits any standard trailer hitch receiver. Please note that your receiver must be frame mounted to your vehicle and not simply bumper mounted. Bumper mounted receivers are not designed for shock load and should not be used with the ditch hitch system. First, insert the solid aluminum bar into your standard frame mounted receiver. The bar is secured by one of the two specialty pins. You will notice that one pin is slightly smaller than the other. Use the smaller 5 8 inch pin when securing the solid aluminum bar. The specialty pin is then secured with a safety clip that opens and snaps into a locked position. Then place your fuse link strap into the U-bar and secure it to the solid aluminum bar using the second larger 3 quarter inch pin. Again, the pin is secured with a safety clip and locked into position. It's that easy. Only use ditch hitch nylon straps with your system. Never use chains, ropes, or any other towing apparatus. Repeat steps one through six for both vehicles. Now that the vehicles are tethered together with the fuse link strap, it is very important now to go through the Ditch Hitch Vehicle Recovery Pre-Job Checklist. This is a series of 18 important questions for both parties to review and sign together. This ensures that everyone understands the task at hand and all the necessary components are in place and secured. Once you have reviewed and signed your pre-job checklist, you are now ready for vehicle recovery. Here are a few tips on how to best use your Ditch Hitch system. First, make two attempts with a static pull. This means that you are simply pulling the rescued vehicle. You are not shock loading at this point. If this is unsuccessful, make two attempts at shock loading with four foot runs. If the vehicle does not move, make two attempts at shock loading with six foot runs. Should the rescue vehicle move even a few inches, continue with six foot runs. After following the previous instructions, if the vehicle is still stuck and does not move at all, Call for additional vehicle recovery assistance. If you have purchased the Snap Trap system, please follow these instructions. The Snap Trap is a safety strap that is used within the Ditch Hitch Vehicle Recovery System. Simply thread the 2 inch fuse link strap through the Snap Trap's nylon eyes. Then place both straps on the inside of the U bar unit of the Ditch Hitch System. Ensure that the end unit of your fuse link strap is cradled on the inside of the Snap Trap. This will prevent potential damage to your diffuser strap while in vehicle recovery mode. The snap trap is a safety tool used in conjunction with your primary fuse link strap. It should never be used as a primary strap for vehicle recovery. 